After years of chasing its future to the west, the city of Temple has, in recent years, turned its attention back to Torin Green's neighborhood. I stay on the east side. They built a brand new rec center. Right across the street from that is a, is a city pool. Now, city leaders say kids of all ages will benefit from the public-private partnership that will polish three faded gems of the past to put more spark into East Temple. This is something we've been working on, something that, that council and the public uh, has uh, striven for, and it's, it's happening. John has his shovel upside down. Go! City and business leaders turned the first shovels of dirt on an $18 million project to bring back the Hahn Hotel, the Arcadia Theater, and an old Sears store into new apartments, a civic auditorium, and business and retail space. So it's an 18-month project, and we're shooting for um, grand opening around summer of 2023. The idea is to bring more people downtown to live and to give them more choices and things to do, all in historic properties restored to their original luster. At 40,000 square feet, the hotel originally featured a restaurant on the first floor. One whole floor was dedicated completely to apartments. The top floor, that was home to a 4,000 square foot ballroom. Plans called for this hotel to offer the kind of luxury usually reserved only for the big cities. City leaders made their move in 2018 after realizing all signs in the future show that after years of expansion toward Belton Lake, Temple's best path to growth lies in its long neglected east. And as we can revitalize uh, further toward the east and let uh, the folks that live in East Temple uh, know that, um, that they're part of Temple, they're important to Temple, I think it's going to revitalize uh, toward the east also, which is very important to the city council. Reconnecting the city to its older neighborhoods and why Torin Green says full steam ahead. In-depth, in Temple, Dennis Turner, 25 News.